Welcome back to the Simplest PS Brothers. And we're, I, I'm, we're here with my son Casper. Casper, do you like a guitar man? He's nodding very quietly, but he's a he's a crocodile that can't speak. Yeah. So. Can you see the dancing frogs, Casper? It's the only thing really. You know what? Your understanding of this, Casper, is equal to ours. Yeah. Basically, this is the thing with this kind of Japanese game that I think would really appeal to like infants. It sort of fits on their sort of level. Of just like, yeah, stuff is happening. But at the same time, I, I do not believe in infants. Hand eye coordination would be up to this game. Somehow I don't think so. Maybe Casper should try. Casper try to play this game? There you go. There you go. You just press buttons and move the thing around. Move the thing around and press all the buttons. He's not doing much worse than me. And you gotta push this button too. And push this button. Good job. Casper's really kicking butt. That's it. Good start. So far, you're not getting any damage. That's good. What well, is the charge Make, up stage? The now we're in battle stage. This is the most important button right here. You gotta push that button lots of times. I'm sure you're gonna do it, Casper. Ah. So, just a little hint three year olds and Guitar Man. Not, not the best combo. Well, good try, Casper. Now good try. Let's try Uncle B. Try. Yeah, now I'm gonna try. You did as well as a three-year-old could be expected to, Casper. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. But these frogs are about to meet their maker. And by that I mean they're going to meet a much larger frog. Or the game designer? I'm not sure. Or the artist, probably. That, that person had a bone. Did he? Had a bone? The person. The other person? The guy in the bee suit? Mm -hmm. Well, he had a trumpet. Maybe he has yeah. a bone, I don't know. Yeah, well, that... He has That's, a trumpet? Yeah, he has a trumpet. Is, is bone the new lingo you kids are using these days to describe a uh, trumpet? You can just say yes. Whether yes. It, there you go. <laughs> the cast was hip. You're, are you done with the lingo? Ah. Well, you're already at maximum power. Not really much you can do. I wonder if you can lose power in this segment. I do. If I screw up, I, I lose power. I think. No, I didn't. No. No, that seems to be a bit of a waste, but whatever. Well, it's giving you time to get the power up. Yeah, I know, but once you've got it, it just seems like... I suppose the music has to go somewhere. Yeah. Dude, this guy's stamina is very high. It's like the thing with bosses with lots of HP. Yeah, I'd rather have a boss have low HP but have, like, insane amounts of damage than a boss that, like... This is hard, and I'm not doing as well as it is the first time I feel. Yeah, you just go straight for those bits. Is it crocodile eating your balls? Nah. <laughs> is there a crocodile eating my balls? Ladies and gentlemen, the innocence of childhood. Casper, walk over this way to show them the crocodile eating, your, eating our balls. There you go, everyone. Crocodile eating my balls. That could, that could be the name of the song. Like, it sounds like the name, a title of a funk song. It sounds like a Grand Funk Railroad song, or like a, uh, uh, what's the one, the, the, um, uh, Funkadelic? Yeah. It sounds like a Funkadelic title. I gotta take it on the Grand Funk Railway. Does it smell bad? So, uh, so you're not supposed to wiggle at all? It just wiggles yeah, it just, goes, it just wiggles for you. It's just him doing a whammy ball. You think this guy, you know, as a horn guy, would like maybe cooperate more since the song really can't work unless you both work together? Well, that's the thing about battling. That's pretty good. I thought, I don't know. I didn't have confidence that one. Yeah, well, you made it. That one I felt good on. I'd say the good thing about this. This is oh. like, I'm sure this is, I think this is the cast of, um, uh, of Rainbow Connection here. I was gonna say it's like the Blue Brothers, like if there's, they. Well, there's, a, there's a crocodile eating your your balls, uh, 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 Uncle B. Sorry, I was not looking at the screen. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's okay, Casper. Yeah. I usually have to pay for that kind of treatment. <laughs> that's right. Like, he goes to, usually goes to a club for that kind of thing. Oh, that's pretty good. 
Oh, my hands are gonna cramp so hard after this. You know what? You've, you're, you're, you've, got, you've got the upper hand. That, that, that bear... cramping hand. I'm... Why are you doing Whoa, this? Ah. <laughs> I didn't even see it. Okay, you can play with that one. You were actually winning until that one where you just stopped doing anything. That one. I'm hoping. I'm just gonna call up Nintendo Power right now. I'm right. See what they have to say about I'm, um. Uncle B, I'm hoping. Thank you, Castle. I'm hoping you. Okay, you've got a slight chance of winning. I'm just gonna call up Nintendo Power headline and see if they. Yeah, yeah, Guitar Man. Nintendo 64. PS2? They do PS2 games now that they stopped existing. Oh cool, that's helpful of them. Um, yeah, I'm on the second level. Does not doing Third anything level. help? Third level, Blake. They're gonna give us wrong information! They, they said yes, it helps. Don't do cool. anything. Cool. You have a slight chance of winning despite the fact that you're being decimated. I lost again. All right, well, let's fast forward till the end of that level. I'm feeling really tense as you get closer to the end of this battle. I'm getting tenser and tenser. Enemy too. Ugh. I'm so um, glad I witnessed that. This is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> That's very bluesy. You mentioned earlier um, the Blues Brothers. Yeah. Uh, have you seen the second Blues Brothers movie? Uh, this movie? No, we talked about this. We had a whole episode about this. Well, it's very swampy. Is it? Yeah, there's a big swamp section. It's like a sewer level? No, the movie. No, no, it's a sewer level in the movie. Yeah, the whole movie is a sewer level. No, it's swamp. It sucks. It's literally a swamp. Are you sure that this is bad cinematography? No, it's like in a swamp. It's like swamp people. I'm saying the, the visual is all swampy and hard to make out. Is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying that there's a section that takes place in like a voodoo swamp with like a voodoo lady. And it I know, but like that sounds awfully racist. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm into the final. Welcome back, guys. I hope you enjoyed the Super Smash Bros. We're gonna just well, he seems to be just lounging. Oh yeah. Oh, he's he's, he's absorbing it with his butt. If you use this one long note, it really feels really depressing. No, yeah, those, like, Guitar Hero is the same thing. You'd miss, like, one long known to stand up for, like, 30 seconds. And, like, you'd go make a sandwich and, like, you know, play somebody for a few minutes. <laughs> Not bring them to completion, but, you know, get them to the kind of just getting a little bit frustrated. Yeah, I understand. I understand. You get them to the point where, like, they need to just, you know, they ask you for something else, like, because your mouth's getting a little bit dry. Yeah, exactly. And you just, there's only so much dick sucking you can do. Oh. Ah! Uh, he's drowned. Ah! You drowned a man in a bee costume. I drowned a man in a bee costume. He just wanted to sing you a song. And now he's dead. And That's what happens when you when you died. It happens. just faded out. There was no evidence that he hurt you at all. You drowned him. Yeah. You sick fuck. Yay! Well, if you've enjoyed this episode of the Super Serious Brothers, next episode we're going to drown a kitten. C. Is it possible to get anything other than a C ranking? Yes.